Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use Formwise for coaches, the powerful use cases for coaches, again, in any niche, whether you're a business coach, a marriage coach, or you're pairing this with your coaching program. I'm going to show you how to transform your coaching frameworks into powerful AI tools using our platform. So again, going to walk through just the quick use cases on what you can do with Formwise and the things we've seen a lot of coaches do using our platform is that you can create instant AI tools specifically for your coaching programs that basically walk your students through exactly what you're coaching them to be. We'll walk through some examples here a little bit later. Again, you can white label AI as well. So you can white label a chat GPT to fit your unique coaching brand or niche. Uh, we think of this as almost AI-ifying yourself so your students can ha basically have access to you 24-7. Uh, we can also create client-specific tools inside of Formwise that, again, are highly engaging. They're brand-specific, uh, especially if you're teaching a specific framework. Um, your clients are going to love this because they can only get these tools through your coaching program. It's a great way to AI-ify your existing coaching services. And of course, if you sell a course, this is it's extremely easy to integrate AI into the courses. All the AI tools you build inside of Formwise are 100% white label and you can embed them within any type of portal. So again, here's some examples. Here's a quick Tony Robbins chat, which will walk you through how this was set up. And on the right, we have a quick internal toolkit that you could, again, brand to your theme and iframe it within your existing gating environment. So we call these white label tool sets. They're just a bunch of toolkits where you add all your tools in one place and you iframe. Um, and then on the left side, we have a white label ChatGPT where you can add custom instructions, your data, and really not make it so open-ended where, where it's just a ChatGPT duplicate, but it's actually a chat that is going to help your students achieve whatever you're teaching them. And again, it's all embeddable, it's all available, through your portal. So let's dive right in to the Formize dashboard. So let's jump into the Tony Robbins tool real quick. So this is just one of the type of tools you're able to create inside of Formize. This is essentially just a white label chat GPT. Um, on, on the left side, we have a few uh, theme options. We have the dark mode and the light mode. We have the instructions tab. So this is where you can actually add your prompt to basically tell the tool what it's supposed to do. So it's not open-ended, so it follows specific guidelines, so it collects specific information before continuing to the next response. So in this case, this is just a quick example. This is a Tony Robbins AI one, so I'm telling it to basically represent the Tony Robbins company and speak in the tone of Tony Robbins. So um, again, this is 100% embeddable. I can add a quick description here on the left side. I can add a placeholder text for down here, and I can add a greeting message. So right now it doesn't show the greeting message because I also have the conversation starter. So you can pick one or the other. If I decide to do the greeting message and I can actually hit generate and Formize will actually generate a greeting message based on my prompt above. So if I choose to use, if I decide to use the greeting message, it's not gonna use the conversation starters. So this is just a great way to sort of have the chat almost initiate the conversation. And then of course at the bottom, we have the model. So as of the time of this recording, we have every OpenAI engine available. We, we are working on non OpenAI engines that will be available very soon. You can also add additional knowledge to your tool. So if you wanna add data that OpenAI is not trained on like a PDF, a CSV file, a URL, you can absolutely do that by clicking on the Your Documents tab and uploading that data. And again, we have a little notice message here at the bottom and all the responses are stored on the back end. So you can use this to collect leads or just to really, I mean, I've seen some people add the, this to their homepage on their website. So it is open-ended and it is powered on your OpenAI API key. So let's jump over into the other type of tools coaches can make inside of Formwise. The next thing we'll discuss is a quick digital strategy lead magnet. Again, this is just an example, guys, of how the Formwise Builder works. We're gonna walk through some of the components here. So as, as you guys know by our name, Formwise, we are a form builder, uh, especially when building tools. If you're gonna build a static um, task specific tool, maybe something that's gonna generate a audit or generate some email campaigns, 
you'll want to start by adding the fields so we can collect information in order to get that output. So in this case, I'm collecting four questions and at the end I'm collecting an email. So I'm collecting the business name, target audience, sales process, and the challenges they've had in the past when implementing digital marketing. And then I'm collecting an email. So this is where the magic happens. So if we jump into prompt builder, we can actually see that we have a few prompts here that are gonna power our tool. If we go to the first step, I have my instructions here on what to do with the information that the form is collecting. So it says, I need you to generate three custom digital strategies for my business. You will act as our brand lift marketing engine to provide these below. And there I have a business name, target audience, sales process challenges. And again, I can map anything I, I collect in the form by just hitting the at symbol and I can map that into the actual prompt instructions. This is essentially um, the actual instructions that the tool is gonna follow. The end user is not seeing this. Um, so whenever the end user fills out that form, it's gonna run it through these instructions and show the output. So I'll, I'll show you what that looks like. Let's go ahead and hit the X here. As you can see, I have another prompt here. So it's gonna actually prompt chain, which let's actually test this out in action. So if we jump in here, this is just, again, a, a specific tool that's going to generate a digital strategy. So I'm going to just make up a fake company here. People in Chattanooga that need morning coffee. People come through the drive-thru. Uh, people can't find us on Google. And I'm just going to put my quick email. And once I hit generate custom strategy, it's going to run these inputs through my prompts on the back end. This is just a really simple tool uh, in, that was built inside of Formwise. This is not a complex tool at all. It's, it's basically running it through two different prompts and it's generating a quick output. So you can imagine for your coaching clients, students, whatever your course or, or, or your coaching program is teaching, if, if you needed to follow a specific framework, you can build unlimited amounts of these tools and actually iframe these tools anywhere you need them to be. So if you're using a coaching portal like high level, like school, like UpCoach, all of those platforms allow you to embed tools inside of their portal. So essentially you're able to provide a bunch of tools that your students, your coaching clients can only get through you. And it's extremely easy to integrate. All it is is some embed code and you're ready to go. Now, if you wanted to provide a quick toolkit, let's just say you created a bunch of AI tools and you wanna share them all in one place. Well, we have something called tool sets and tool sets is essentially a portfolio page of all of your tools in one place. And you can choose which one of those tools appears on this page. You can brand this page. You're able to create categories. You're, you're able to update the icons. This is a tool set builder right here. You're able to pick what tools you want to appear on your tool sets. As you can see, I have a quick fitness planner here. I can add them into categories. I can add a description. I can lock a tool. So if I have a freemium and a premium tool set, I'm able to do that. Um, on the left side, I can choose to power this with my API key or with my client's API key. I can add categories. I can, again, add my logo, remove the branding. Everything is white labeled. And, and of course, grab that embed code. There's a few other customization options here that you'll also be able to find and fine tune. So if we jump into our tool set here, this is viewing the tool set within the actual browser. This is not the embed code, but this is actually within the browser. That way you can actually share the actual tool set via the browser as well. So here's just an example tool set with a bunch of tools. This is actually what the UI looks like. Uh, let's just do something here. Let's generate a few tweets. And then this is what the UI looks like for your end user. And the cool thing about these tool sets is you can turn on chat mode, which is a setting inside of the tool set. And you can actually chat with the results as well. So this really takes these static tools and really turns them into conversational tools in case they need to be fine tuned or tweaked. So we're seeing a ton of coaches really AI-fy their value ladder, add AI to their existing uh, digital products and services. And really it's, it's a great downsell and it's also a great micro offer to get people into your broader offer ecosystem. So I hope this quick demo was awesome. If you need to book a live demo, you can hop on a live demo on our website. We have a Facebook group. We'd be happy to answer any feedback or any specific questions you have until then.
see you guys.